YouTube channel and for today's video I have a skincare routine. This is going to be my everyday skincare drugstore option and also something a little bit more high end. So the first thing that I want to mention before going into the products is my skin type. I have combination skin I and my t-zone is where I tend to get the most oily throughout the day but the rest of my skin is pretty dry. Notice that whenever I cleanse my skin and moisturize it even though I think oh I don't want to be greasy I don't want to be oily but if you moisturize your skin you will start seeing less oil so if you're a person that's super oily and you just don't put moisturizer on trust me start putting moisturizer on and your skin's going to clear up and like not be as oily because you're giving it that moisture that it's lacking that's why it's creating so much oil because it's lacking moisture as my skin is not acne prone if i use face wash with acne medication in it it irritates my skin and actually creates more breakouts stay away from dairy as well try that out to see if your skin clears up i noticed a big difference in my skin when i cut out dairy the days that i go to the gym i like to cleanse my skin twice for the gym this is exactly what i use just a you know very gentle cleanser like this neutrogena it says that it boosts softness evenness and radiance and i can say that that is how my skin feels when i use this cleanser it's nice enough to clean my skin and it smells nice um, I do notice that my skin looks brighter and a little bit more glowy when I use that and I'll put a little bit of moisturizer on not nothing too heavy. I come home and I take a shower after the gym I want my skin to be a little bit more deeper clean. This honestly has just changed my skin altogether. It is the Ole Henriksen Truth Face the Truth Gel Cleanse and Seaweed Extracts and it smells divine. It smells so good, so super. It brightens my skin, it smooths my skin and it keeps my skin clean deep down to my pores. I can feel it working. You know what I mean? I got mine at Sephora for, uh, it was like this little kit. It came with the trial, the travel size or small size of this one, which lasted me a very long time. I want to say about two months. For $35, it had the small one of this the moisturizer and the truth serum which i use all those three things for my everyday skin routine after i use the cleanser with my toner and i'm Natural using remedy stairs witch hazel and this is the aloe vera formula and it smells like roses i like to use this all over my skin with a little cotton pad i just go all over i got this off amazon i want to say for it was between eight to twelve dollars i don't really remember i will have the price link go in with the ole henriksen truth c rush brightening gel cream and this was the one that came in the packet that i really joined these together like i said i do see my skin way more bright um i have less breakouts because this is exactly what my skin needs these two products here together and i've posted them on my instagram before i talked about it there as well i'm gonna link that below my instagram if you don't follow me you should these two things together i highly recommend if you know you're having breakouts or if you're feeling like your skin's a little dull or try a gentler cleanser and see how your skin reacts to that the other thing i do like to add but usually i use this at night is the truth serum now this is the one that came in the travel size oh girl i have butterfingers i swear i drop something every single day my life is not complete until i drop something now this is a travel size one so it's small but i've had it for like two three months and i still have half I like to use this at night i just kind of layer it all over my skin just so it really hydrates and penetrates deep down and this as well i've noticed brightness more radiance in my skin and in the morning my skin doesn't look as tired i want to talk about spot treatment when i do break out usually whenever aunt flows here i will get like one big painful pimple somewhere on my skin either on my chin or my forehead and whenever those times do come like i don't want the pimple to be in anyone's face like super big red and painful so what i like to do is i like to add this mario badescu drying lotion onto the pimple and this one says that it's best to use at night. That way when you're sleeping, the acne medication can be doing its thing, drying it out. And this really does work. I do notice that in the mornings, like my pimple is a lot smaller and it's less irritated, less redness, or sometimes it's completely gone. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video about my skincare routine and what I like to use on the daily. I hope you guys try out some of these products, look them up, tell me what you think about them. And also in the comments down below, let me know your skin type, what you use on your daily skincare routine, what works for you. Thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you later. Bye.